now, but here's how they made it through to the finals. We will go out there and put out two performances that deserve a place in the final. Talk about determination. You went for it like a sex starved beast. <laughs> It was all down to entertainment, hard work, and dedication. You topped the leaderboard every week. Well, thank you very much. I think that was passionate. When do you see our tango? We're going to give it plenty of that homie. Yep. You both molded into that tango. You became one person. So I was mesmerized by the pair of you and the chemistry. Yeah. They're the only semi-finalists not to get a 10 in this competition so far. Will it be enough? That's it. Chris and Ola can do no more. It's tough. It's fierce competition. We've given it our go now. We can't do much else. Fingers crossed that we can get there. Only one of you will remain in the competition. And that couple is... Chris and Ola! That was lovely. <laughs> Please welcome Chris and Ola. <laughs> Get your fan dancing. Finally. We're allowed to say the F word now, aren't we? Yeah. Yes. Finally. I cannot believe it. I must admit, I do feel a little bit guilty. I've, I've been on television this morning and I've had loads of emails and. I, you know, Brian and Ali were awesome, and um, some people are saying I've taken their place, and I do feel a bit guilty. I do really I love the fact that, yeah, you were saying that you'd done a radio interview and somebody called in and said, you've ruined my weekend. You've ruined my weekend, Chris, because Brian and Ali went out. I, and I know, and I do feel it, and I, I'm really pleased that people are passionate about it, about a competition. Yeah. Um, but, I mean, must admit, I've got mixed emotions about it right now. Do you? Yeah. Do you, do you know what was quite interesting? Let me say this to you, because I am now a studier of both your faces. When they called out your name, normally there is whooping, there is wailing, you are jumping up and down. There wasn't that. She was shocked. I was very shocked. Obviously not prepared for that at all. Uh, I thought that that is the last dance, last two dances for us, last Saturday. Um, and then we went through, very surprised, very happily. Obviously, I'm very happy. She didn't speak for five minutes. Did and I'm not, not joking, no. and that is a world you record. You seem emotional life. even about it now. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm, you know, I, it's, it's great for me to be here still, and I'm enjoying every second of it, so it's great. Let's talk about Greg Revel Horwood, who said after your run, but no improvements from week one. Um, how difficult is that to hear? Because he was, he was very upset about your hands. Do you know, and if I'm being brutally, brutally honest... Yeah. I treated every dance that night as if it was my last, because I truly thought it was. And I didn't care. I really didn't care. At that moment, of course I take everything the judges say, but I didn't really care, because I loved every single second of that. Yeah. And I hope people liked it, but I really loved it. I know it wasn't great, but I loved it. Um, let's talk about your Argentine tango. Mm -hmm. The most brilliant outfit, by the way. Let's Thank just, you. Let's just <laughs> flag that up. Uh, it was so technically difficult, and you nailed it. Did you enjoy doing that one? Yeah, I mean, you probably just saw there, um, I just kept saying, I love that, Ola Chops, I loved it, I loved it, I loved it. And we enjoyed that, Argentina. We loved it, yes, we definitely liked it a lot. It was everything that sometimes, um, I think, um, lent a mesmerising or something, which really was very flattering. It just felt so right for us. Yes. That, that's my favourite bit just there. Thanks for showing that. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely brilliant. I mean, um, on Saturday, Len said that you epitomise what he loves about Strictly, which is just, you're throwing yourself in. There are so many forum comments about you guys, I can't read them all, but there's one from Sinistra7, who says, Chris has shown willingness to try anything and fearlessness to go on the dance floor and entertain, even though he knows he might get a pasting from the judges. <laughs> Never once have I seen him look self-conscious, but I think that it suddenly all fell into place on Saturday. You were like, I'm doing the run, but I know it's the hardest dance, and I'm going to do this with the Argentine tango. It's that willingness to throw yourself in. The self-conscious thing was all your work. Remember Salsa Week? Yeah. And I had to do a solo. I mean, what, I think what happens with us is every time we get the chance to go for the next week by yeah. the public, 
Um, we're going to give everything in that week. We're going to do the best performance we can because it might be the last week. So I think every week by week we were doing that. We were just enjoying it every single week and we're enjoying it still now. And we got the chance again to dance in the final and we're going to do absolutely the best. You, you guys finally are going up against uh, Ricky Whittle. <laughs> I know. I'll ask him the same question. How, how are you going to go about trying to beat him? We... I must admit, we started our dancing yesterday. Yeah. Uh, we were doing, what's it called? Uh, Lindy Hop. Lindy, I want to yeah. call it the Jitterbug, but it's not. It's the Lindy Hop. Yes. We started that on Sunday, and I think the difference in talent was evident as we were starting. I was going, one, two, three, Ola, and I looked around, and there was Ola and Natalie going. Yeah, yeah. Look, we've beaten him once. We've yeah. only beaten him once in 13 weeks. Yeah. I keep going on about it. The Charleston week. Yeah. Um, okay, he's brilliant. And he's a lovely guy. Yeah. Some, I've got to find something I hate about him. Um, it's but hard. We will okay. give everything we've got to All make right. sure that people at home say, yeah, they deserve the place in the okay. final. Guys, thank you so win much. We'll see you again oh, yes. on Friday. Thank and you. win the trophy. Yes, yeah, win the trophy. Thank you very much. Chris and Ola. Thank you. So